Okay, so of course I have to keep you guys up to date on everything that is going on. Now, if you guys have not seen my two previous videos on this topic, go watch those now because everything goes in order. Now, if you guys are up to date with everything going on, then you'll know on my last video, Corey and Carmen basically posted some photos of Molly's alleged baby's father. Now, Molly has three kids. Now, Corey is claiming the father of Molly's daughter is also the father of the son that she's claiming could possibly be Corey's. Now, I'm going to let her explain everything else here. As always, I want to know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Um, me and my daughter, daddy, like I said, the last time I talked to him, he got upset, sent his girlfriend over here to bust the windows because he cannot be around us. He has charges on him, right? The reason why me and him got into that big ass argument is because I told him, hey, can I get your paper paperwork? Can we meet up? Can I get the paperwork that you did on TJ? Now nah, I threw that shit away. Why the fuck would I keep it? I said, okay, well, do you mind uh, doing another DNA test? I'll pay for it. I already got the kit. I just want to change TJ name instead of keep having to go through court. The whole situation blew up. He was trying to make it seem like I was just this evil bitch. I lied to him the whole time about TJ. He was just doing the fucking most, okay? So I'm like, well, damn, so I guess he ain't going to participate. I come back home. I pull up in the yard with my churn, and I look on the ground. I see fucking glass because my house sit up high. My windows is high. Like, bitch, bust out my windows for the nigga. You need to go to Texas and go to court. No. That's not that's not how it's going how, how it's supposed to go. Social worker told me he have to come back down here. This is where we conceived TJ. Girl, they hmm. say girl, get the test over with. Just go get the test. What the hell? I already have it. I just told you that. Y'all really, y'all really be tripping. Y'all know that. So if you put on my child's board, they will have to do the DNA testing, right? Okay, look. That's one thing too. If he don't show up for court, they can automatically just go ahead and put him on child support. But I don't want child support. I just want to change TJ's name. I just want to take, I just want to change TJ's name and I'm going to take the, the, um, Mahalia daddy name off the birth certificate. Cause I, I mean, I'm trying to go ahead and change everything before TJ get old enough to remember this. TJ two years old right now. He's not going to remember much. He's not going to remember two. So I'm trying to go ahead and change his name before he remembers, before he starts spelling his name, rem learning how to read, write all that shit. Trying to go ahead and change it before TJ get too big. That is all I'm trying to do. I've been trying to do this. Y'all keep saying, why wait till now? I've been, 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 been trying to do this when I was pregnant, when I had TJ. And I remember when I was holding TJ in the NICU, I had a whole flashback cord. So, I mean, I've been trying to do this. Like, memories. TJ triggered them. So, don't y'all think I think about DNA tests almost every day? Y'all tell me I'm just not bringing it up. I've been talked about this shit. This shit is old. This shit is old. He just now... I guess because people are paying attention. I guess because I, I just like... Okay, I can't get his attention through privately, right? He blocked me. Every time I would bring up TJ, he would block me. So, and I couldn't get um, Carmen's attention either because he blocked... Okay, he went on her play, page and blocked me. And he told her to block me off of everything and shit like that. So, she did it. Like, I mean, I don't blame her. Shit. I mean, I can't fault her for that. Oh, well. I could not get him no... I can't get his attention no way privately. I had to do the shit through the public eye. And you see I got his attention, right? You see how mad he is, right? Every time I would bring up TJ, he would block me. He would ignore me. All that other shit. This is the only way I can get his attention. And y'all see, he admitted on his live several times, I'm not doing the damn DNA. I ain't doing that shit. 
my thing is if you feel like the baby not yours why is you just why you just want to knock the shit out why you won't knock the shit out get the shit done the shit is childish the shit is overrated stop telling folks i'm harassing people and all that other shit stop that shit because either way it go you had stirred up the shit some way somehow like how you did with me and her me and carmen you did the same shit you would go to carmen you would tear her shit about me so she wouldn't like me you would come to me you would tell me shit about carmen so i wouldn't like her so we wouldn't like each other so we wouldn't communicate so we wouldn't figure out what the fuck really going on you mind manipulated mind manipulated both of us you did both of us like that and then as y'all can see when we went live and he seen us and he heard me on live he said why the fuck you on live like that nigga started tripping he snapped the phone from the gun, everything. Like, he was looking at the phone. His face started looking ugly. If y'all if y'all good at reading body language, I know I am. Both my parents are deaf. That's why my facial expressions are so strong. Sign language is my first language. I read body language real good. His his attitude and his shit that he had going on in that life, that shit showed every fucking thing. That shit showed everything. The way he snatched her phone, the way he was hacking her page, going and he did me like that too back in the day. I had my shit was viral as fuck. My page was viral, y'all. This nigga so crazy. He was texting himself off of my page. And then after he after he had showed me, like, okay, look, this not me, this not me. It was him. This nigga changed my password to Cory Miley 31. Only me and him know about the number 31. Only me and him knows. This man is fucking crazy. This man got a real crazy side to him that y'all do not know about. I'm trying to tell y'all that shit now. Yo, I ain't trying to get too deep off in the shit. But just know, this nigga real talk. This nigga's crazy. Y'all re really was thinking it was me. I'm glad the shit went off on live. I'm glad y'all seen the shit firsthand. And as y'all can see, me and Carmen always sit down and was able to talk to each other. It was him who did not want us to communicate. It was him who did not want nothing to be resolved. You know why? Because he keep going back and forth from me to her, me to her, me to her. Right? Damn, y'all coming so much shit. Y'all ain't got to tag her. Me and her already talked. And y'all ain't got to tag him. He's blocked. A hurt man is a dangerous man, sis. Like my grandma always say, hurt people hurts people. He is a hurt man. He is a hurt man. Boy, whatever you want to call it. Carmen did not post him. That wasn't him. That was Corey. Corey posted my other baby dad. Like I said, if my baby dad beat his ass, I ain't got shit to do with it. If he find out where you lay when you come down here, I ain't got shit to do with it. If you come down my grandma trying to throw off them cars and shit and your shit get end up shot up, I ain't got shit to do with it. Cause why the fuck you why is you triggering that man? Why is you fucking with that man? That man don't fuck with you. That man don't like you. You think that man like you? And he was in love with me. You so dumb. Don't you think he hurt behind TJ? And you post that man. When your ass get beat the fuck up and somebody recorded and posted. And my baby daddy, get some clout off of be your ass. Don't get mad. Don't get mad. Be glad, motherfucker. Because you posted them. I know I did not make... I know I did not make him by myself. It's just... I've been going so long without help. You get what I'm saying? I've been going so long without help. So... It don't mean nothing to me, if that makes sense. I know I did not make my kids by myself. My other baby dad not even on child support. I just don't care about shit like that. I just don't care because I got money. I'm not tripping about no money. I bought my own house at 20 years old. I'm not tripping about no money. You feel me? You get where I'm coming from? But you is right. You right. I shouldn't have to take care of them or do everything by myself. Both of them need to step the fuck up. You is right. No, get child support and save the money for TJ when he wants to go to college. 
Somebody else told me the same shit. I'm waiting. If anything, he of course he gonna act like he don't like me on social media. Think about it. Of course he gonna act like he don't like me on social media. Duh. Like y'all don't be thinking, bro. Y'all don't be really actually thinking. Y'all don't be thinking for um like to put yourself in that predicament, if that makes sense. If like have y'all ever thought about like okay, what if what if just what if I was in this girl position and me and this man had some past and he dealing with another woman as well. Y'all both got kids the same age, but he claiming this child that he's on social media platform with, but the ones that he's not on social media platform with, he not changing it. He not claiming that child. Y'all got to think about it both ways. Y'all can't be thinking about it just one way around. I wish you said, girl, turn the comments off. Well, I'm not finna be up on here too long. I just had to say what I had to say. I'm, um, done with this. I'm done talking about it. I just had to get on here and say that little part about me harassing and him killing my grandma and all that other shit. Like, what the fuck? Who care if he like you or not? Right. I've been there before my life can relate. Y'all bash her, but she's single and he the one married. Show right by that, baby. So you really talking about my child? You really talking shit about my child? He did say something about killing my grandma. It's on live. It's on the T page. It's on YouTube. DC, get the fuck out my shit before I beat your ass, DC. For real. I beat your ass up. Looking like dead long legs. DC, what you doing, man? Fuck all that other shit. Whoever talk about kids can go to hell. For real, for real. He said you can die. What? Y'all, okay. He said you can die, the baby can die, and everyone that believes you can die. That sounds like him. That's fine. Y'all tripping. Y'all tripping. Y'all doing too much. That's a Looney Tune right there, baby. Yes. Y'all is going back and forth with each other and it's fucking shit. That nigga was just drunk. How I'm going to plot to do something like that to the only person that I had at the time? That's so fucking dumb. I was 15 years old. I was a child. That don't even sound. That sound retarded. 
that sounds like something coming from somebody who is so upset. So that shit right there, that that if you gotta take it that far to get some attention off for of the fact that you need to do the fucking DNA test again, that's crazy. Like if you don't wanna do it, that's fine. I told you I'm not gonna make you do it again. That shit is fine. You ain't gotta sit here and talk about my grandma and all that other shit. Same way you, you talk about my mom. I'll talk to you. You talk about everybody. You don't give a fuck about nobody but yourself. You very selfish. Let, let's talk about how you use people for to get fame. Because when you by yourself, when you single, you don't get no fucking likes. You don't get no likes for real. But when you have a girl, when you have somebody beside you, you get some likes. Let's, let's keep it real. Let's keep it real. Because honestly, you're not all that. You're not all that. That's how you know when somebody love you for you, hoe. Because you is not all that. Stop that. Stop. Real shit. Stop. You is not fine. You is not none of that. You all right. You all right. You ain't no fine ass nigga now. You is all right. Your gums bigger than your teeth. You is all right. Right. That nigga use people. That nigga use people. Fuck. Girl, you the only one hating. Get the fuck on. And you slow too. He really not. No, he is not. Man, that man, man, that nigga mouth so motherfucking wide shit. That man is not all that for to be doing all this. Like, yo, I don't even care. I don't even want you. I don't want you, bro. On, on everything I love, I'm straight. I love being single. I love living my life. I'm young. I want to live my life. I don't regret my kids. What comes with sex is kids. Like, when you in love with somebody, you do shit. Like, come on now. I don't regret my kids at all. I love living my life. I like being single. I like experiencing stuff. I like not having to worry about another man. I like all that. I like being to myself. I don't like, like, come on now. I don't want to be married. I'm straight. I don't want none of that shit. Like, what the fuck? I don't want nobody. I love my kids. I love my single life. I love being by myself in my own house. I like not having to share shit in my house. I like not having to hear about another man brag, nag, None of that shit. I don't have to worry about none of that shit. I take care of myself. I take care of my kids. I'm straight. I live my life. I enjoy my life. The fuck? I ain't have to worry about another nigga trying to tell me what to do, when, who, or how to go. I don't have to worry about none of that. The fuck? Y'all slow. Majority of y'all. Some of y'all understand it. Some of y'all open minded and can can understand. But the rest of y'all, I already know he called me a broke roach. I already know about all that. That nigga, he too busy talking about everything else but what he need to be talking about. Girl, look at your profile picture. You you need to be pressed about that damn profile picture. The shit is ugly. There you go. I'm not. I don't need nobody lying on me. I told y'all. Ever since. Everything I hit the fan or whatever. Nobody like me no more. That's fine. I'm just going to do DNA with my son and my daughter. That's it. I don't need nobody else. I'm straight. you talking about tell myself i'm not forcing him to take the test i said i give up i'm not finna keep going back and forth arguing about it what is you talking about 
What the fuck is you talking about? Some of y'all don't even know what the fuck y'all be talking about. For real. Nobody said both of my kids is his. Nobody said that. Nobody said that. Why did you like him? He don't have respect for women. Okay, one thing. One thing about that. He wasn't always like... always like that like he got a real love breathing process shit through that small ass head of his with a big ass head it just narrow as fuck but when he think laugh and have a good time and but he everybody got their bad side you feel me everybody got somewhat a bad side but sometimes your bad can overcome the good Yeah, it's just a lot of kids.